You want him to see it, you show him around. If you wish, you will accompany us. I'm sure he'd be glad to remain with us. Come along, Matthew. Shotokan Karate is one of the major styles of Karate. It is one of the most popular martial arts styles taught around the world. This branch of Karate focuses on Kata, punches, hand elbow strikes, knee strikes and kicks. Shotokan Karate was developed by Sensei Gichin Funakoshi in Okinawa, Japan. Welcome to the Karate Ka and let's talk about Shotokan Karate. Let's talk about its history. Shotokan is a style of karate developed from various martial arts by Sensei Gichin Funakoshi. Sensei Gichin was born in Okinawa and is widely credited with popularizing karate do through a series of public demonstrations. Funakoshi has many students at the university clubs and outside dojos who continue to teach karate after his death in 1957. However, internal disagreements led to the creation of different organizations including an initial split between the Japan Karate Association and the Shotokai followed by many others. As the most widely practiced style, Shotokan is considered a traditional and influential form of karate do. Well, Shotokan was the name of the first official dojo built by Sensei Gichin Funakoshi in 1936 at Mejiro and destroyed in 1945 as a result of allied bombing. Shoto means spine waves means the movement of fine needles when the wind blows through them. Shoto was Sensei Funakoshi's pen name which he used in poetic and philosophical writings and messages to his students. The Japanese kan means house or hall. In honor of their sensei, Funakoshi student created a sign reading Shotokan which they placed above the entrance of the hall where Funakoshi stopped. Gichin Funakoshi never gave his system a name. Just calling it karate. Gichin Funakoshi had trained in both of the popular styles of Okinawan karate of the time. Shioryu and Shorin Ryu. After years of study in both styles, Funakoshi created a simple system that combined the idols of the two. He never named this system, however, always referring to it simply as karate. Shotokan training is usually divided into three parts: Kihon (basics), Kata (forms or patterns of moves), and Kumite (sparring). Techniques in Kihon and Kata are characterized by deep, long stances that provide a stability, enable powerful movement, and strengthen the legs. Initially, a strength and power are demonstrated by instead of slower, more flowing motions. Those who progress to ground and brag belt level develop a much more fluid style that incorporates grappling, throwing, and some standing joint locking jiu-jitsu-like techniques, which can be found even in basic kata. Kumite techniques are practiced in Kihon and Kata and developed from basic to advanced level with an opponent. At last but not the least, rank is used in karate to indicate experience, expertise, and a lesser degree seniority. As with many martial arts, Shotokan uses a system of color belt to indicate rank. Most Shotokan schools use the Q-dan system but have added the other belt colors. The order of color varies widely from a school to a school, but the Q belts are denoted with colors that in some schools become darker as the students approach Shotokan. Dan level belts are invariably black, with some schools using a stripes to denote various ranks of the black belt. Sensei Gichin Funakoshi himself never awarded a rank higher than Godan, fifth dan degree black belt. Well, this was all about Shotokan Karate. I have covered all the basic details about it. Let me know in the comments what you know about Shotokan Karate. Let's talk in comments. A master of karate might be a dangerous man. Well, but so could any man with a pistol and knife or any weapon for that matter. Remember, what we practice here is a sport. If a man would kill with karate, he would also kill with any other weapon. <laughs>